Have you ever wanted to take a gas powered pressure washer and convert it into an electric pressure washer? Well, I wanted to do it. I've been thinking about it for a while and as you can tell, I did do it and it works. I bought a pressure washer with a 7.8 horsepower pump, sorry, motor and a pump that goes with that 2700 psi 2.7 gallons per minute that is much more powerful than just about any electric pressure washer that you can buy i got it cheap because the motor needed a carburetor and was and a muffler and it was generally speaking in in pretty rough condition but it was running i was able to test it with um starting fluid and made sure the pump was good and also this kind of pump if you ever want to do this uh this one a particular one is by inter pump group it's a tt 2530 and i think it is a good fit for my five horsepower 220 volt motor it's a, a motor off of an air compressor and i I actually have a couple of these. Um, if you do want to do it, the shaft size on this motor is 5 8 and the shaft size input shaft uh, for the pump has to be 3 quarter inch. So I bought a 5 8 to 3 quarter inch shaft adapter with the um, key that comes with, with it for the keyway. It's a special key. It is not square. It is rectangular. It's a little taller than it is wide, 3 16 I do believe. What made this project slightly more difficult was that my electric motor does not have a mounting plate, so I could not mount the pump to the electric motor. I had to take a piece of angle iron, uh, well, angle bracket that I happen to have laying around and I drilled a center hole, and uh, before I drilled all the way through, I, I made an X pattern so that I could drill the mounting holes for the pump in the correct location and have it perfectly centered to the center hole. And uh, I did have to make a few little adjustments. You could tell that, you can see that I have some washers underneath the pump, because when, when it was all said and done, the pump was actually slightly lower uh, than the shaft, output shaft of the electric motor. So I mounted the pump and ultimately actually ended up using skinny washers underneath the electric motor to get them in, get everything in alignment. I wanted it to be perfectly aligned so that there's not too much uh, wear, uh, too much force on the electric motor and also not on the pump. Yeah, that's it. So now I have a five horsepower electric pump. It does run on 220. So I wired up this RV style plug, 30 amp uh, rated plug and cord, and I just plug it into 220. If you want a smaller pressure washer, uh, if you get a smaller pump, you can probably use a two or three horsepower electric motor and run that in 110. But uh, 220, uh, five horsepower, it's going to be 220 uh, pretty much. So if you have any questions, please post your questions in the comments below. And what is it that they always say? Please like and subscribe and share. And who knows, maybe I'll get some, uh, some viewers. Maybe I get some likes on this video.